Good afternoon. Happy summer solstice. I um, was sitting here today thinking about how hot it is outside, and um, I know that it's everywhere in the country. I'm seeing comments from friends all over the United States and the world. It's um, For some people, it's a pleasure. For others, we're just going, oh my gosh, how hot can it possibly be? So I thought I would share with you a couple of ideas about ways to um, reduce your energy consumption, save some money, and maybe um, still be cool in the desert. A couple of things you can do that are simple. If you replace some of your light bulbs with complex compact fluorescent bulbs, that would be great. Um, when you walk into a room, if you have a light switch that does a ceiling light and lights, an, uh, lights a whole room, you might want to not use that and use a desk lamp instead. Way less energy and not as much heat. And as you leave the house, reduce the thermostat by about 10%, and while you're gone, that saves on the peak of the day and what's being put out all over your town, your city, your country. Um, you also might want to use an ice tray. Do you remember ice trays uh, rather than the electronic ice maker that you have because the, uh, they use about 14 to 20 percent more energy to make the, ice, the auto ice maker than if you use an ice tray. And um, lastly, make sure that you change the filters in your air conditioning unit. Uh, so many people get called out. We have air conditioning friends who get called out to people's houses who they say the air AC isn't working. And it isn't working because they haven't changed the filter. So simple and easy thing to do. Save yourself a service call with your HVAC technician and help the airflow. These are some simple things that you can do to be a little bit more green, to be a little bit more healthy, to save some money, and to stay cool on these hot summer days. Enjoy the season.